I got it into control until the bomb exploded. And the bomb that exploded for me was thyroid cancer, which I had in November 22. And I was just thinking, he caught up with me, really did catch up with me in the drinking. And no matter how healthily I was living, aside from the alcohol, exercising, eating well, organic food, all the tunnels they say in France. No, the alcohol was the one that got me in the end. And I had thyroid cancer. And yeah, that was quite a, an ordeal. Uh, it took about eight months to get over that. And did I stop? No. Because halfway through the treatment, I had to put my chemotherapy to one side because on New Year's Eve, I was taking the bins outside. I had a bottle of wine, my usual Nike bottle of wine. Put the bins outside, it was pitch black. I tripped over a log, fell onto my arm, broke it in two, the point where the bones came out again. And I had to go to hospital, have that repaired, fixed back together, and didn't tell anybody. So this is now my secret shared with you all. That was a drug. That was totally self-inflicted. And that deferred my chemo by six months until my old fix, because I was not allowed to wear a cast whilst in treatment because of the radioactivity that would penetrate it. So I knew deep down that this was ridiculous and something had to be done. And so by that point, drinking had become so miserable and I was very aware that I couldn't stop myself because when I left hospital, I couldn't not drink. I just couldn't stop the alcohol. And I thought, this is a problem. I decided to do something about it. 